What's up guys? I want to show you my 36 yellow fin. It is going to be up for sale. So I figured I'd kind of do a little bit of a run through uh, with it. So basically it started up here at the front. I got a Rodan trolling motor that comes with it. It's been super, super helpful with other boats I've had. This is a brand new 2023 Yellowfin 36. So I got all the bells and whistles on it. I was gonna go through them all with you guys. So starting with the upholstery, I did get multiple different colors, three different colors on it. And uh, this Yeti cooler, I don't know if it's gonna come with it or not, but th uh, two very big size fish boxes. And then you got these two port ones starboard little uh, hatches I got fresh water and raw water and um, all black matte powder coating here is the inside got some stuff in there right now I got two extra batteries two extra house batteries for like overnight trips and different things like that um, bunch of rod holder cup holder combinations and uh, got that so yeah that's uh kind of the front of the boat not much I, I got a lot of electrical outlets i got four of them so i got four electric rod holder or outlets for rod holders and six um zero degree rod holders as well i forget how many rod holders i got on here but there's a lot of them uh, i'll put it in the caption but uh has the eyes and glass that goes around that comes with it it's in the hatch right now um i am in the process of trying to find a windshield it's gonna be like a little shorty windshield that i can get because the yellow fin doesn't come with a windshield because it would hit your shin so if, even if you get something a little bit shorter i was thinking about doing like that but i do have a full second station up top so let's work our way to the back of the boat so all this here is for the ising glass and uh yeah, so I got the big boxes here. These are side hatches. Just got some rope, same thing on the other side. And then got all the controls here. So the nice thing about this is I got the twin 17 inch Garmin GPSs. Um, I love it. They are amazing. I've always been a Garmin guy. Simrad, uh, all my buddies run Simrad. I almost went with it, but I was like, I know Garmin, so I'm gonna stick with it. So um what else got the stereo system and i added a couple switches here because you also do have the switches here and you got all your switches in there and uh it's got underwater lights um spreader lights light bar on top i'll go through the second station in a little bit but nice fold down seats uh the three colors uh, i think they look really really sharp and as we walk our way into the back, uh, I did get nine rod holders here. So that's that. And the live wells. Live well, live bait to me is super, super important. So I went ahead and got the three live wells. It's a huge well. I don't know the exact gallons of it, but that's that. And then I got the floor well uh, right there. And then uh, I got the back well here too. Uh, nice big big live wells and I think it's a beast marine sea chest that's in here nice clean hatch I had to uh, paint the entire inside black I know that's standard now uh, three fuel tanks in here you got a big center and two um, saddles and live well switches three pumps and yeah that's uh, that's that the boat is literally brand new uh, I think it has a few hours on it and yeah i was gonna put it up for sale other than that that's that um let me climb up here i'll show you so this right here is the sunroof that gets you to the second station hold the button there and it's kind of a pain in the butt i'm six two so i'll show you how i get up there basically put one foot there one foot there whack your head and then that's that All right, so this is all the controls. You got a 12 inch Garmin up here, throttles, and this is a new feature from Yellowfin that I had them custom do because the old style had you sitting 
on this. I don't know if you can see that, but that's how it was. Got some rod holders ready for pitch baits. A nice thing to put your feet up on so you can sit up here and just kind of relax and drive the boat. That's it. So yeah, I'll put all the information down in the comments or in the section where you put that stuff down the bottom. But yeah, it is uh, an awesome, awesome boat. Got the radar right behind me. And yeah, I literally built this boat for me. Uh, I got a baby on the way. So I was thinking about putting it up for sale and seeing what happens. But please uh, let me know if you have any questions. My cell phone number is 941-662-6164. Not really interested in putting it with any brokers. Don't really want to pay the 10%. So uh, if you're a broker, please just uh, look for somebody else to post their boat up for sale. That's about it, guys. I uh, hope you enjoyed it. Uh, I know it was kind of a quick walkthrough, but yeah, it's up for sale. Let me know if you're uh, looking for a 36 elephant. See ya. All right, just wanted to show you what the boat looks like at nighttime and uh, with all the different fancy lights that I got on it. Um, I also wanted to show you that the boat has uh, nine point hours on 9.8 hours on it, so it might go up a little bit. But uh, I want to go to home and vessel. Where's that? Those are my lights for the lights that are underwater and the lights that are up underneath the gunnels. So let me turn these lights off and then so you, have, you can see those lights there and they're also all different colors you just hold down or tap it and do whatever color you want to do do green um, it also has underwater lights and those are also all the way around the boat but if you hold down on those you can do them any color that you want like I said, they go, I got two off the back and then two midship. And yeah, these are all the gunnel lights that are up in here. And let's shut the underwater lights off. Go back here, get some spreader lights on. Check this out. Get these lights on. Look at that. Nice and soft. Um, I want to show you the light bar. This thing is super bright. Turn it on. Watch how bright that gets. Totally insane. So, yeah, that's uh, kind of my boat. And, yeah, if you have any questions, please give me a call. I think I mentioned just about everything. I'm sure there's a couple other things that I'm forgetting to mention. Um, but, yeah, the rod holders, triple uh, 300s. It's just uh, a fully set up fishing machine i love the feature of the three live wells these hatches up here are super big so if you know a 36 elephant um one cool thing uh, that i did to this jetty 350 put two rod holders right there and two rod holders right there not like i don't have enough rod holders but i just don't like rods on the gunnels when i'm running um i wanted to get some back here but uh, Yellowfin told me that I needed to have a backer plate in there and I wanted to add it on later. But they said if I put it on now, it will pull the screws out through the back. So um, I wanted to add another six rod holes in there, but I was being cheap because Yellowfin was charging me crazy amounts of money for little simple things like that. So I just figured I'd do it myself. And uh, then they told me it will pull out. But so I did the cooler thing. But yeah, other than that, it's a sick looking boat, um, rides great, top speed is 60 miles an hour, and other than that, it's, uh, it's amazing. So give me a call if you have any questions, 941-662-6164, and that's it. Thanks.